Foster. He is set to take on Steve Harker in the alcohol funny car final today. First time these guys have ever met in a final. They have met three times previous, and every one of those times, the runner that hails from Australia is one. I think the interesting note is, and we've seen over the years, some guys just do well at some tracks. They feel lucky in that environment for whatever reason. The Lucas race that's held here annually on the regional trail is called the Cavalcade of Stars, and four times Chris Foster has won that event. He's always had good fortune at this racetrack. You gotta like his chances there, but Parker is coming out of the number one qualifying spot, and you heard him say earlier, he's picked up on a combination. He's getting fine-tuned, and it uh, wasn't so finely tuned in the last pass, slow to a 565, but another opportunity to make better. And there is Adam Rhodes, still got his Chris Demke team shirt on because he's been helping. His tuxedo socks. Yeah. I, I don't know where he buys socks, but I hope I never accidentally stumble into that place. <laughs> he's one colorful character to say the least. Foster out of the number 14 qualifying spot all the way into the final round. That does not happen often on the Lucas Oil Drag Racing Series. Does have an Indy win, but that's the only one on the national event tour. Steve Harker has four, looking to add a fifth. Advantage Harker out the gate. Finish line, it's still there. A whole shot win as a 562-7 beats the quicker but losing 561-6 of Foster. Everything was there for Chris, except for the difference at the starting line. It was a 400s advantage by Steve Harker. You could see his car make that little move first. And even though it quit at the finish line, only 240 miles an hour. The 257, it ran long enough. For Harker, his first win since Topeka, 09. And there's the photo finished by half a car length. Give it to the runner who hails from Australia but calls Gainesville, Georgia home now. Steve, first win in about five years. How did you put it all together this weekend? Well, it's been a while, but uh, having uh, good sponsors and a new one, Crane Trucking, Crane Transport, uh, Cam 2, Speed City. Leander's clutch, all that helps, but uh, the crew, got two new guys, done a fabulous job. We're not used to turning them around this quick, we're a bit out of practice, but we did it, we got here and we made it, so it's uh, it's great to get a win. And it was a whole shot win at that, congratulations. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, I missed all you, but <laughs> it nosed over, I thought he might have come around. Nice job, Steve.